A Valley resident is sharing his near-death experience after spending 40 hours stuck in Joshua Tree National Park before being rescued. News Channel 3's Kalen Frope brings us his survival story. Help! Help! This was La Quinta resident Robert Ringo last Thursday trying to call for help after falling and breaking his leg while walking around Quail Mountain in Joshua Tree National Park. I uh, started trying to at least turn over so I could get onto my back. And when I did, it was just it's unbelievable pain. Little did he know at the time he had broken his femur, left stranded and hurt. He did bring two liters of water with him, but with the desert heat. It's the first time in my life I've ever experienced um, uh, no saliva. <laughs> With no way to signal help, he began recording himself, not knowing if he would make it out alive. And of course, there was zero service, and I knew there would be, but I did. I had tagged my location and shared it with my son, Ryan, before I left. The, that's just something that I always do. His family started looking for him on Friday. With no luck, Ringo spent a total of 40 hours in the wilderness. I saw some juniper bushes, and I and I, I wondered if they were edible. You know, I know that you have some of them. So anyway, I somehow scooted up this place, ate some juniper berries, saw what I thought might be flowers, but they were all dry, so I wasn't going to eat them, and then came up on this flat plateau. It was on that plateau at 9 o'clock on Saturday morning when he finally heard a search and rescue helicopter above. I never got to the point where I thought, I'm not going to make this. I just had a confidence and a faith. The Joshua Tree Search and Rescue Team rescued him and brought him to Desert Regional Medical Center. Ringo says he can't thank his rescuers, who he calls angels, enough for finding him. I'm just so grateful. They, because I, you know, I mean, if I had never been found, it would have been devastating for my family. I have a very large family. Caitlin Thrope, News Channel 3. Mm, what a story. Robert Ringo had surgery on his leg and is expected to recover. He says he's looking forward to hiking again.